Drew. And welcome to the very first playthrough of Red. No introductions are needed for the rest. Thanks, sweet all. Uh, hello there. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People call me the Pokemon Professor. <laughs> this world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, Pokemon are pets. Others use them for fights. <laughs> Myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. First, what is your name? I can go for it. Well, you, be, you, you, you pick your name. Just be David. Yeah, I'll just, just be, be you. I'll just be me. Be myself and I. Where's the lowercase? Yeah, you can do lowercase. Oh, so that's how you do it. That was before touchscreens were invented. <laughs> <laughs> Back in my day, touchscreens were never invented. Good we job. have to press everything by fingertips. Right. So your name is David. <laughs> This is my grandson. He's been your rival since you were a baby. Um, what was his name again? <laughs> I could do a super effective joke here, but we're not going to do that. <laughs> we could go with the traditional flu. Yeah. That is technically his name. Oh, that's but right. I remember now. His name is Blue. Yeah. I think they changed the name for uh, Japanese to English, so we're not yeah, going to uh, yeah, yeah. David, your very own Pokemon legend is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon awaits. Let's go! Okay, I got done playing with my Super Nintendo. I want this thing. Secrets. Okay, with my potion handy and everything, I am ready to face the wolf. It's dangerous to go alone. Here, take this with you. Wait a minute. <laughs> Wrong <laughs> game. <laughs> I just had to throw in a joke in there. But let's get serious. For your protection, I know. <laughs> Here, come with me! All the specs. 
Well, I just really feel like I'm muck right now. <laughs> hey, I don't know what that's supposed to mean. <laughs> I don't know either. All I do know is that tackle should not miss. We can still make it. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, 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 Just getting right down to the water. There we go. Ooh, Critical hit. Okay. Thank you, Bulbasaur. I'll give you a cookie later. Oh wait, lava cookies are not invented yet. Sorry. <laughs> Whew. All right. So we're gonna go on a merry way and smell you later. Do you have a better catchphrase? Uh, just kidding. It's a classic. Pidgey, please excuse my rudeness. So I guess now would be a good time to like discuss what we're going to do as far as the rules of the game. Yeah. So for first off, uh, every Pokemon that we uh, we can only get like the ones that are in the that haven't been in the Pokedex yet, but an exception that we don't have any Pokeballs at the moment. So yeah. So, whenever we run across a Pokemon we haven't captured yet, we have to attempt to capture it. Have to. Yeah. Um, it's basically Ultimate Pokedex Challenge. It's not a Nuzlocke, but we are adopting the rule that oh. if a Pokemon faints, you have to put it away forever. Um, we're also adopting We're, we're the just going to put it in the PC box. We're not going to throw it in the trash. But, you know. Yeah, we'll call it the dead box. Yeah. And we have to nickname everything. Nickname everything. Even if it is insulting. <laughs> so, we're gonna go... I'm gonna go see if I can get the Pokeballs as soon as I get Poke uh, Professor's present. Okay. No, it doesn't look like it. We'll have to come back. Before I do go, I'm gonna go grab a potion that's like up here. Top of this cut uh, tree you can cut. 
apparently. Up, skip, and a jump. Down our way to... would give us the Pokeballs in the first place. Alright, so we got the Pokedex. <laughs> okay, now we can talk to the nice lady in the other house. Now let's see, he did say that... Oh, I guess he didn't get his Pokeballs. Yeah, that's kind of odd. Wait a minute. Maybe one of these guys will give us the Pokeballs, I'm not for sure. Or maybe I'm thinking of something else. He might be thinking of Fire Red. Uh, it could be true. Man, I'm just so used to Fire Red. Oh yeah, the map. Map. Where's the map? Give me the map. It's the map. The map. It's the map. The map. <laughs> oh gosh. Alright, so we're going up. It, so it always bothered me that the map never really spoke Spanish, but that's okay. <laughs> I don't think I don't want the map to speak at all. <laughs> that would be kind of weird. Why would you want a map to talk to you? We already have those. It's called GPS. Yes. yes. <laughs> GPS. We don't want that. They lied to us. <laughs> oh my gosh. All right. You go away now. It's whipping its tail. And I think that's all the XP I want to do. Because at this point, I'll probably one shot hit. Uh, Level 2 Ratatatas or Pidgeys. Mm -hmm. Pine tree to be able to have a really good uh, start on the levels. Let's see if we can call it a butt. Uh, 
Uh, well, <laughs> <laughs> you'd be kind of stuck with that name. Yeah, I know. Watch too much super effective comics. Alright, so what do you think? Alright. So it's, so it's kind of like a fat pigeon, I guess. So let's see. Well, they have... Okay. So we'll just call it John for now. It just... <laughs> yeah, so we're gonna just call it that for now. Man, you only know, lived on four health. But okay. So anyway, we are going to go heal up the Pidgey. And maybe we should go over to the next route over and get some stronger Pokemon. Yeah. Get a Nidoran or a Mankey. Yeah. Let's see, either one shows up. Maybe make these are super rare. Trading machine. Oh, it almost looks like this. Huh. Let's see what she has to say. Okay, cable club. Okay, sure. We'll save it anyway. So, oh, what happened? Oh, it's just telling us okay. invite a partner with you or. Join a partner who has issued an invitation. That's cool. Wireless trading. Yep. But we don't have a partner at the moment, so we're just going to go. That blows my mind. Well, they made it easier to trade, so... I'm going to go see if there's like some hidden item over there this route before the rival shows up. So I'm going to take a quick peek. Just don't go too far over, like, up here. I, I think that's just a fire red, but... You never know. Yeah, it's just a fire red. Yeah. With one HP, <laughs> you almost lost your... Pidgey. <laughs> it's okay. You won't turn into fried chicken. I'll take good care of you, hopefully. In my stomach. <laughs> There's Joy. My Pidgey almost got itself killed by a Nira. Can you please heal it? Thanks, lady. Uh, oh, she said something about. She said something different that time. I'm not sure what she said. Uh, that's odd. 
a lot of odd things usually happen. <coughs> Alright. Let's see what's up here. There's you, dude, that I could talk to. I'd what rather not. <laughs> rather not. He has nothing interesting to say. Let's see. Anything in here? Game. Yeah. I, I forget, was there a same type attack bonus in the first game? Uh, they get... I don't know if Stab was invented in the, in the first generation, and I feel like I got a sneeze again, but it's not coming out. Oh, uh, gosh! Ah, uh, spores, man. Drive me nuts. So, we also wanted to talk about that um, new announcement that came out this week about Pokemon Sun and Moon. Oh, Sun um, and Moon. <laughs> I, I put out a video earlier this week um, discussing um, the day before it was really announced on the Nintendo Direct or Pokemon Direct. Oh, gosh, yeah. And uh, it turn, yeah. turns out that I was completely underestimating. <laughs> Everything that they were gonna do. I mean, like, yeah, I, I acknowledged it, but I did not think it would actually be a thing. Yeah. yeah, even using that same title and everything that they trademarked oh, it for. Oh, yeah, they, they trademarked the title and the logo, which is incredible that we knew like six hours before it came out. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, essentially, it was so funny. It was just so hilarious, I mean. My heart just just blowed up with excitement. No no yeah. the It's really not for sure. But they're they're saying that it could be seventh gen and I, we're thinking that it might actually be seventh gen. But but what are they gonna do with Pokemon Z? What what are they gonna do with all those new like new forms and stuff of Zygarde that just came out? Yeah, it is kind of odd. Or Ash Grew Ninja, how is that going to play into the games? Will it be in the games at all? Yeah, I'm not for sure if it will actually be in the games. I think that's just an anime thing, but the Zygarde forms, I am definitely interested in that. I was hoping for Z, or at least for Sun and Moon to answer that question in connecting to Colos. Now, that would definitely make me happy for the game, but overall, the game should be a blast. Like this one. Mm-hmm. <laughs> And raises up a different question in mind now that we're actually thinking of it. When they were talking about it in the direct, they said that these games you could transfer them to Pokemon Sun and Pokemon Moon, like the Pokemons that we're using right now. Yeah, but we cannot transfer them to XY and I'm gonna really stop that they have already said that. Yeah, which raises up the question, why? Is there some significant Thing, like probably new abilities that have not been introduced before in the Pokemons that are encoded in these. Yeah, are these Pokemon special compared to just standard Pokemon? Yeah. Well, fine. We'll probably find out in the distant future. Yay, Sand Attack! <laughs> oh. I'm so going to make all the NPCs angry at me, but yeah, Sun and Moon. And there's like so many questions to... Did I catch a Ratatata? Not yet. Alright, you go over here. Triggle it. Oh, we both missed. Uh, uh. Okay, I do not like that tail whip. Tail whip bad. Tail whip bad. Okay, pine tree. Nice job, pine tree. Oh, did you kill it? Oh. Oops. <laughs> I'll catch another one. <laughs> uh, okay. I'll try again. I kind of forgot. I was intent. I was thinking I was training it. Yeah. I'll catch another one down here, because there's a lot of ride tennis down there. 
Obviously their catch ratio was that good when we first start out the game anyway. So let's see. Alright, so let's name it Ratatouille. Ratatouille. <laughs> a reason? Because it, it's an HM slave. It's a tool. <laughs> if we don't kill our HM. <laughs> if we don't end up, uh... Always need HM slaves in these good games. So Yeah. Alright. Well that wasn't bad for seven health for this thing. Thing we need to do is really grind, grind up a little <laughs> bit, get our get our levels up to par, and then we'll be ready. Yeah. But we're not gonna bore you with that. Yeah. So we're just gonna just completely and entirely skip all the grinding for a while. So, mm -hmm. and we'll use the honor system. Honor code. So we'll show you everything that you know the outcome of everything when we come back in the next episode. All right. See you later.